guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori, and today I've got the What I Got for Christmas video. And I have a little Wellington. He's visiting right this second. He, they hear me talking to myself, and they've gotta come check out what's happening. Okay, there you go. I thought I would share with you what I got. Just so you know, I'm not bragging. I just think it's fun to watch other people. I thought I would share. So, um, I got a new hoodie from Sarah, which I love, and she's so smart. She got me a tall, because I have a long torso, and I like them longer, so it fits perfect. So I got this, um, some stocking stuffers. We're going to have a taste test on these. Pork rinds, squealing hot, and my absolute favorite of the Max, uh, spicy buffalo. These are delicious. I love these. She also made me for the background upstairs. This is just attached for now, but we can use this board and put it behind me for things I want to highlight. And it says my crazy life. And it's also chalk, so I can write on it. And I love it. And she made it for us. So we love that. That's going to go upstairs. We'll go over the stocking stuff here because that's what's next to me. I got some Dove, which dry hand. Ooh. We all need that. Uh, my allergies, if you watch me for like 10 seconds, you know. So I got a three pack of pocket tissues, which I need to put in my purse. And then when I work at the Buckeye games, I work outside. So she got me some hot hands, which is awesome. And this is four. So it's four different times I can use these. Or one game if I take two and shove them in my shoes, which I want to do. I do sometimes because my feet get cold. And the feet ones aren't as good as the hand ones. So these are great if you have anybody outdoors. This brand is not as good. I use them all winter long. So I was excited for that. And some body wipes. Because, you know. Hi, buddy. Do you want to say hi again? He's like, no, what I want you to do is love me, Mom. Oh. <laughs> He's liking having me home. I only worked two days last week, and I worked two days this week. And the boys, they got presents too. They got all kinds of treats. Um, Sarah got me and I can't wait to put these on something. No problema, iron-ons. Maybe I'll make a knitting bag of some sort and attach those. And then, where'd it go? I had some pins, uh, I'll unearth them. And um, my sister-in-law, Julia, got me this, and her husband and son got me this lip duo. And it's matte, which I love. And look at that color. It's perfect. And Sarah loves me. And so she got me a New England Patriots Alex and Annie bracelet, which I need to wear today. Oh, is it going to show? I need to get a Buckeye one, too. Um, it's Buckeye's Day. They're going to be in the Fiesta Bowl this evening. Well, so I have to get this done so I can get to travel to go to my cousins to watch the game. Oh, my sister-in-law also got me this cookbook to make pie pops, and we're going to make them. There's Alex behind me. Um, it's all kinds of recipes to make pie pops, which I think will be super fun. I'll leave that downstairs. Here's my pin, Sarah got us. She kept the dog ones, and I got the I Love Cats. And these are just little lapel pins to put on, like, my denim jacket or something. I'll put them in there for now. Oh, and my, oh my God, Bubs. In my stocking, I got, um, I love Olaf, little tissue, or uh, ear swabs, makeup swab, swabs. And I love these little tins. And I got some Burt's Bees. Uh, this is coconut pear. I'm excited because I love chapstick. Uh, Sister-in-law and nephew got me these. And these are so neat. You hook them on the side of your plate and you put your dipping sauce in them because I'm kind of a dip girl. I love having dip and stuff to dip my food in. And so I got a four pack. That was super fun. That'll stay down here. Hi, buddy. And I also got some Ohio State cups. Let me bust into this. She ordered these for me. And you know I love my Buckeyes. These are just drinking glasses, but how fun is that? Those will go in... Especially in the summertime, take them to the pool. Hi, thank you. Um, okay, now I got two shirts, but the other one's upstairs. But this one is a llama. 
And I love these baseball t-shirts, especially for like early spring or come fall time or in a cool summer evening. So she got me two of these. Uh, the other one is upstairs. So I got to take that upstairs. I forgot to bring it down. Oh, and I love this. It's, um, it's like a poncho, but it's split in the front. And along the edge at the bottom is a ruffle. I wear these a lot, especially at work because my building is like hot and cold all day long. And she got this at um, Cracker Barrel for me and I love it and I can't wait to take it to, and wear it to work. And then I got a pin I'll show you that'll match it, that I'll wear with it, but it's nice and full and it fits really good. And it'll be nice and cozy in the, win in the winter months when it's chilly in the office, but then later in the day it gets hot. They can't keep the temperature straight where I work. It's crazy. And then uh, sister-in-law Julia made this blanket. It's a like a lap tie blanket. And it says something, but I can't open it all the way up. But it's super pretty, and we will enjoy this in the wintertime, too. Put that on the couch. The boys will love it. Alex, buddy, what you doing? Alex, what are you doing back there? Oh, you come say hi? Here, you come say hi, too. He's like, lady, what are you doing? What you doing? Hi, buddy. Did you say hi? You say hi to the peoples. Yeah. They're all concerned. Oh, he's going to go under the camera. They're all concerned with the pile next to me. Oh, Sarah got me a new paper cutter, which mine broke. So this is perfect timing. And I like this one because I can get refills on the blades at Hobby Lobby, which is right by my house. So that's a perfect. And I did need that. I asked for it. I have a cat in the bag over here. So if you hear crinklings, and he's out now. Um, I bought these for myself. <laughs> I bought some for Sarah and uh, Ellen, my sister-in-law. These are little bags of uh, foot repair. This is all over foot repair, and this is heel repair. And it's um, from Kohl's. That brand is Earth Therapeutics. But they have like a a lid so you can use a little bit and take care of it and then I got myself two pair of aloe socks for the winter time my feet get super dry like everything else um, from a friend up in Cleveland we went to a dinner and I got some really lovely hand soap this is rose water and ivy I love the foaming hand soap and she got me some lily and green tea uh, hand moisturizer and a really pretty ornament that I need to put on my tree. Which goes with my house perfectly. Isn't that pretty? And I love the bells. Actually, I could hang it year round. It doesn't have to be just for Christmas. So I got that from my girlfriend. And then from my brother and sister-in-law, Ellen, they bought me a new Fit Watch. This is the Galaxy, um, Samsung Galaxy Active, and they bought me this for Christmas. Well, that was so nice of them. My Fitbit was dying, so I needed a new watch, so they replaced it with that, and I was so happy. And then they also, um, Ellen gave me, this was her aunt's, and it's a brooch, and I will totally wear this because it's appropriate. It's a crown, guys. Isn't that beautiful? If I get it to show. So pretty. And I'm going to wear it on my shawl. Because I think that would be ideal. So I got that. Um, let me put it in this tin so I don't lose that. I got, this is a, for, I'll open it up because I'm going to stick it on my fridge. It's magnetic. But it's got my name on it. And it ha it's a wine bottle opener. And it has a really strong magnet, so it goes on your fridge. But it's a bottle of wine, but it also opens wine. Isn't that awesome? It has my name on it. I think that is so neat. And I do love me some wine. And so it just holds up, and then you stick it on your fridge. So I need to go put that on my refrigerator. And then they got me um, this little tea cat um, tea bag holder. I drink a lot of tea, and I don't have one of these, so I thought that was perfect. Because I needed that. Um, the boys, while I have it here, got lots of treats. Um, a lovely subscriber sent me these. And someone else sent me two bags. And I totally appreciate that. So they got these. And this is the Catnip Fever brand. And then I have two bags. And each of them got a bag. 
And then uh, my brother, Mike, got them Backyard Cookout, a tub of Temptations for them. So they're excited. And I'm excited to try this. Sarah bought them Party Mix, and it's all natural. So I'm hoping that we don't have any issues with Wellington and his throwing up. I don't think we should. I'll let him have those. And then some Meow Mix. I'll give these to Alex. Um, I do give them separate treats sometimes. Um, Alex gets greenies. Uh, part of him being a rescue cat and being on the street, his teeth weren't so good. I mean, he doesn't have any like major dental issues that I need to deal with right this second, but he does have some gingivitis um, and some plaque and he has nasty breath. So I've been giving him the greenies and Wellington doesn't really care for them, but I give them to Alex. He gets a couple every day just to try to help clean his little teeth. Uh, my nephew got me this calendar, which is awesome. I'm going to put it in my kitchen. And it has a little tiny calendar, too, which is perfect. You always need a calendar to start the year off right, you know? And then, uh, one last thing that my sister-in-law and Aeneas and Atticus got me was a ukulele. I'm going to learn to play the ukulele. Am I in tune? I know one chord. C. We're going to learn to play. That's my goal this year, and I will give you, like, monthly updates. So far, I've learned some strumming, and I've learned how to keep it in tune, which is just tuning it every day. Um, I'm going to get a stand for it. But, yeah, I love it. Um, and they got me that for Christmas so I can learn to play the ukulele because that was a goal for this year, I decided. So by Christmas of next year, I want to be able to play uh, Mela Kaliki Maka, which is the Hawaiian uh, Christmas song. So I have a uke, which makes me happy. And then this, I actually made it um, the beginning of December with my cousin. I think I showed the video of us going to do this, and it's blowing glass. And this is the bulb that I made. I haven't put a string on it yet, but I made a green and red bulb and it's glass. And in there's my air. I blew that. Isn't that so cute? I love it. So I'm going to leave that in the box for this year and put it away. And the next year I can pull it out and um, hang it on the tree. So that was just a sidebar. And then from my cousin, I love my cousins. Um, oh, actually, no. From a coworker, I got this mug. Isn't that sweet? And it's black and white kitties and it says catitude and I love it. She got me that, which I love. Uh, that was from Kim, my coworker. And then my, uh, my Christmas drawing at work, I got a $25 Visa gift card. And that's what I used to buy my mop. Cause you know, I'm 90. And I got a gift card to Michael's. Now from my cousins, um, if you watched my vlog, the little they're not little. My young cousins, they're 16 and 13. Um, this is from them and their mom and dad. And oh, I just love them. And I got another mug and it says, don't stress me out. I can't wait to use these guys. Don't stress me out with the cat ears. I love it. I'm such a crazy cat lady. And then I am not sure if you've heard of this company, but it's called Our Riveter. And it says, since 1972, our family has been specializing in producing custom stoneware pieces from clay. The process of hand-making pottery is time-consuming and labor-intensive. 24 pairs of hands touch each piece during the process. All of our stoneware is lead-free and food-safe. And this is from our riveter and this is a company that supports military spouses while you know they can work from anywhere while their other spouse you know the husband or wife is deployed and it's a an income stream for military families she got me this mug and it's hand thrown and i absolutely love it and it says our riveter and it's like rosie the riveter and it says american handmade and i love this pottery so i'm going to put this out somewhere like on a shelf because I want to display the beauty of that. I'll drink out of it too, but I love it. So I got three mugs, four mugs. I think I have another mug kicking around here somewhere that I got for Christmas. It's okay. And then from that same company, um, it says, do you see the stamp 
Each part of your American handmade bag from the leather strap to the fabric liner was handcrafted by a military spouse. Get to know your Riveter by matching the stamps on your bag to the selfless military spouse at riveter.com. Um, and there's numbers on here and I can go see who made this purse. And it's a like a little wristlet. And I love it. it. Smells so good. It's real leather. And it's just perfect little wristlet to carry around. I'm going to put my stuff in it today. Um, but isn't that beautiful? And it has this. And it has a set of dog tags on it that says, Our Riveter, American Made. Uh, this was made in 2019. And then it has RR199. And I think that's the person that built it. And this was made in Fort Brad, North Carolina. And I just think that is amazing. And it is great support of our military and their families. So I love that so much. And then the last and foremost best of all, I love everything. But this came from my cousins as well. Oh, we've got Catopoly. Yeah, we sure do. We're going to play Catopoly. I'm going to play it with the kids. I'm super excited. So yeah, that was my Christmas. Whew, that was 16 minutes of show and tell, but I hope you enjoyed as much as I enjoyed sharing. Um, and I hope you had a great Christmas as well. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.